On the trail of the missing Banksy, a graffiti artwork that disappeared from a North London wall is withdrawn from auction in Miami. Now, uh, a Banksy mural, which vanished from the wall of a shop in North London only to end up at an auction house in Miami, has tonight been withdrawn from sale at the last minute. Well, the artwork called Slave Labour uh, shows a boy hunched over a sewing machine, as you can see, making Union Jack bunting. It was expected to fetch more than £450,000, but the proposed auction of it had provoked protest from local residents here. Sangeeta Maiske reports. This piece of art was Banksy's gift to the British public. Stenciled by Britain's best-known graffiti artist, it appeared just before the Jubilee on the wall of a North London discount store. But then it disappeared, only to suddenly reappear in an auction brochure in America valued at over £400,000. Tonight, minutes before the auction was to begin, it was then dramatically withdrawn from sale with no explanation. A victory, perhaps, for the residents of Wood Green, who've been demanding to have their Banksy back ever since it vanished. Banksy gave us to the people and it should be returned to them. I hope they feel sufficiently guilty, but I very much doubt they do. Wood well, Green isn't really known for anything apart from... Well, it's not known for anything really, is it? So it was, uh, it was nice to... It's nice that it was here. They're taking it to Miami, they're going to auction yes. today. Feelings here may be running high, but Scotland Yard says no one has reported a theft. Exactly who chipped the image off the wall and who is selling it remains a mystery. The company that owns the property, Wood Green Investments, has declined to comment. The protesters here say that they accept that technically it would appear, at least for now, that no crime has been committed. But what they argue is that by taking a piece of art that was clearly designed to be on public display is an act that's both morally and ethically wrong. The piece, um, you know, called Slave Labour, um, was a bit of a cheeky critique um, of capitalism. So the idea that that piece is now being sold in Miami, um, I think, runs completely counter um, to the spirit in which it was given. Banksy's satirical street art has appeared in the nation's public spaces for well over a decade. Some has fallen into disrepair, but his influence on Britain's newest urban artists is profound. Possibly inspiring this, a painting that tonight appeared in the void where Banksy's original image once stood. Sangeeta Maiska, BBC News.